Reese, I know you coached her at UVA. She recently signed, you know, a 10-year contract at the University of Rhode Island. Obviously, Don Staley as well uh, at South Carolina um, has rewritten the rules in terms of what adequate and equitable, you know, investment looks like. Because obviously, like I said, you, you did so much during your time in terms of what you fought for and what you achieved. Could you tell me kind of what that means to you? Um, knowing that, you know, you were such a big part of their lives, being their coach, and also just for women's basketball uh, to see these types of contracts. Well, I'm just extremely proud of both of them. Um, I actually, my last contract was 10 years. So, um, and that was an equity issue because they issued a 10 year contract to the men's coach. So they automatically did it for me. Um, and I fought hard for equity during my time at Virginia as a basketball coach. And it's just great to see them both uh, pick up the torch and fight for equity. Some of the people that were really, really vocal about it um, have passed away mm-hmm. or they're no longer coaching. And so now we're seeing some people pick up the torch and two of my players are picking up the torch because they knew what we were fighting for very early on. And, and they were taking, taking a part in it back when they were players. So that's why I'm so proud of them is that they aren't afraid and they, and they stepped up and made it happen. And, you know, and I think Rhode Island um, really, was smart because they would have they would have lost Tammy. Oh yeah. And you know, Tammy's just too good for not getting everything she needs to become competitive on a national level. And that's where she wants Rhode Island to go. I think it was pretty obvious early on, you know, she's a rock star and and fits everything you need, you know, to build right. a program. So-